这还只是武汉旗人邱福义所练奇功的一小部分，而他今年八十四。别急，这只是前戏，接下来的更精彩。上面在干嘛呢？把这皮子打破。Right here, you can see the wind blowing. Right there, as it jumps, see right there. It's chi energy is pushing through the air. Next, is the air. 啊，我没有功夫。可究竟，邱老见我们还意犹未尽，就又来了一手硬功夫。All right, one. This is Richard Cespedes, and uh, I'm here with the.、Uh, We're、um, here to talk about chi energy and how to、uh, what I think about it, and from my、uh, um, from what I've gathered from the videos that I've seen, and from、uh, well, basically just the videos,、uh, I believe that chi energy is、uh, not just chi energy is much more、uh, vast than just what you know the Chinese do. You know, like you see the ch、uh, Chinese people, they、uh, know how to. You know, chi energy is like, you know, it's like meditation. It's burning things with your hands. It's、uh, levitating things or moving things with your mind. You know, it's like, it's like,、uh, it's like being able to、uh, to heal people. It's not only those things, but chi energy is 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 any mental thought、uh, or 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 any or or anything that you feel or or anything that you、uh, think. Chi energy is anything that you do almost. Chi energy to me is is a is a thought that arises in your head. Chi energy is the power of、uh, of thinking, the power of positive thinking, the power of、uh, of influencing influencing others to believe in in you by by、um, by thinking highly of yourself. By thinking, you know, if you want to achieve. And become,、um, you know, a successful businessman. You know that's always the case. Or if you want to be a famous singer or just someone famous, just by thinking that all the time creates a certain form of energy that you carry with you, because you're creating this energy of thoughts in your mind. And when you walk out in public, or you walk out talking to your friends, people sense and feel that because. You're thinking about it all the time, and the energy you're carrying, the energy, the mental energy everywhere you go. So people start to think it, and they start to believe it. And so, to me, that is also chi energy. Chi energy, chi, chi energy is almost anything that you do. You know, it's uh, it's, cause uh, it's like uh, being caught in the zone of exercising. That's chi energy. You know, getting into your own zone when you're jogging three miles. Is chi energy, you know?、Uh, praying to God and crying to Him is chi energy, you know.、Um, thinking that you want your family member to survive a cancer surgery or to to live through a, a horrible accident when he's in the hospital—that's chi energy, you know. That right there is chi energy, and、uh, that has the power just as much. To you know,、um, you know, being able to think things positively, highly of yourself, and affecting others around you, is the same thing as using your mind to burn things with your, your by behind your by、um, harnessing your heat, body heat, and transferring it through your hand, which is what chi energy is, and by sparking people, which you saw from my last video, and、uh, and to, to me, that's what chi energy. Chi energy is almost anything that you do. Anything that you put your heart and your mind and your thoughts into, and you're doing it all the time, 
and people are affected by it and they feel it, that is chi energy. And chi energy is anything that you're doing. And the thing is though is that what I want to also add too, I want to make the video short, is that um, a lot of people have trouble, um, they watch these videos on YouTube and then they, they kind of have trouble um, understanding uh, how to kind of find their, uh, to, to, to kind of, you know, do these amazing things. It's kind of hard to them to comprehend or to find their, find their own chi. Because what it is is that when you see these people on YouTube, these amazing people doing these amazing things, burning things, lifting things, or pushing things with their mind, or shocking people with their hands, or whatever. The, the, the thing is, though, is that people don't understand is that chi they, they harness chi energy. Um, they found their own flow. They found their own chi. They found their own um, internal technique. They found, uh, they found their own way, their own unique path into harnessing their unique chi their unique chi energy everyone has their own uh unique path of harnessing and finding and learning how to kind of grasp their chi energy because other people how they grasp their chi energy how they go into this adventure of discovering their abilities to lift things with their minds or burn people with their hands they have to they have to go within themselves and they have to discover for themselves what what their chi energy is and how to get a hold of it because each person is their own separate individual you know um, each each person has to find their own way of how they can maneuver and discover their own their own intricate complex uh, way of of, uh, of harnessing and, and using their chi you know, because every person is unique, so every person's self-discovery of chi is unique, and that that's probably the reason why a lot of people cannot find, cannot, uh, cannot seem to grasp or understand how to do these types of amazing things or just to meditate, because the people that they're trying to copy, they, uh, they have found their own path, and so as an individual, you have to find your own path, your own way of how you harness your own special unique chi energy to do these amazing things it's a, it's, a, it's the same thing as um, learning mathematics or learning uh, to do art or learning how to fight you have to you have to discover the bravery within yourself of how you fight what drives you to fight what perpetuates you you it's kind of that's the same thing as how finding Chi energy and I want to also talk about that uh, I think that Chi energy is going to be something that is going to be used a lot in the future that as time passes people are going to discover it and they're going to harness it and life will become more enlightened and uh, it's going to be almost like Star Wars we're going to be living the Star Wars fantasy for real in the future because when when uh, Luke and, and Anakin and all the other characters talk about the force they're talking about Chi energy because they're you know, like Yoda uses his powers, you know, his chi energy, his force to lift the spaceship out of the muck in the in the swamp. So like, you know, that 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 is chi energy, but they interpret it as a different word as force. But I think that in the future we're going to be able to we're going to live the Star Wars fantasy. We're going to live it, you know, uh, um, George Lucas basically was ahead of his time and he saw into the future. You know, and, and uh, we're going to live that fantasy of being like Anakin and using the force to, you know, to fight evil, you know. And so, and, and all the technology is going to be there, and the chi energy is going to be a reality. Everybody's Not everybody's going to be able to use it or harness it, but people will know it, and, uh, and they're going to see others using it and mastering it, just like how they master the force and Star Wars. And so that's going to be real. I really do believe that chi energy... It's going to be something that's going to be realized and it's going to be used a lot and there's going to be a, a handful of individuals across the world that are just going to amaze people with their powers and uh, and again this is Richard Cespedes and I just want to talk about that and I think I missed a couple of things um, I think uh, just just before I go I want to talk about what Chi Energy is Chi Energy is a uh, is a uh, um, 
I want to talk about Michael Jackson. Though. Michael Jackson utilized chi energy. His his own unique chi energy. Chi energy is is anything, anything that's used your mind, your body, your belief. And uh, he made people around him always felt something from him. They felt that there was something mystical about him. People talked about how mystical he was, how magical it was, how how amazing it was to be around him, and like that he was surreal and he was unbelievable. You know. That it was almost like magic. And the thing is, though, is that the reason why people felt that was because Michael Jackson believed in himself that he was magical. He used his own thoughts to, to help him believe that he was a magic pers magical person, that he was special. That, and he thought, he, he kept on thinking this and he carried this in his mind, his energy in his mind, and he went out in public and he carried it with him and others felt it others felt that hey you know this guy Michael Jackson he is magic you know he is special I sense that he's something weird or something surreal about it unreal you know and that's the thing is that anyone can do that you just have to believe in yourself just like how I said about the business person you know um the business the successful businessman becomes successful because people believe in him but of course he has to have you know he has to he has to have success you know, a uh, uh, a logical proof. You know that he has success and that he makes deals with other companies or whatever. But, but if you want to take it to another level, you want to be a successful businessman. You have to think that you are. You have to believe that you are. And people will sense it and feel it because you're gonna carry it around. Whether you want to be a musician or whatever, and that's the truth. And that's what I try to do a lot in my life to try to carry around positive thought and positive sense of self. And uh, again, it's Ricky says, but it is. Uh, the guest watching keep the video as short as I can normal linked video and it's about chi energy and just keep up and have faith take care of that